Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Echo's Pregnancy, week seven. She's finished her seventh week, and we've started our eighth week. She is rather rotund. She's very round. Come here, Echo. Oh, we got cheese, but look at that face. Look at that baby. He's so sleepy. Echo, why don't you go visit Cheesy? Echo, come here. Echo, go say hi to Cheesy. You. Go say hi to Cheesy. Echo, come here. And there's Echo. She's going to say hi to Cheeseburger. She's like, yeah, I've seen him before, Mom. It really isn't that big of a deal. He's scared. He's standing still as a statue. No, oh, he's never scared of her. I don't know what the deal is this time, but look at the belly. She's rather rotund. Right, Echo? Are you rotund? Huh? She has a hard time getting around. Come here, puppy. Echo, come here. Come here. Go, Echo. Go see Cheesy. Go see Cammy and Cheesy. Cheeseburger's camera shy. <laughs> That's good. Now, she's like, now I'll go see him. Me see Cheesy. Mr. Cheeseburger. She's going to lick him all up and clean him. She's going to try to clean Cammy. Echo likes her private time with just us. We really, really try to get some private time going for her. There's just a lot going on in our house with the kids and the animals and preparing for the babies and I think sometimes it gets a little overwhelming for her so we take her off to the side and real quiet you're getting old she's only three years old she's getting gray well it's kind of a dog thing doink This morning she came up to me when I was sitting on the sofa, six o'clock, or excuse me, seven o'clock with time change. But I was sitting on the sofa this morning very early. She comes up to me and shoves her face in mine and I start snuggling on the side of her face and she's happy as a little lark. That's what she likes. Mm -hmm. Let's see what she's gonna do. Oh, hey, I can't, well, I'm gonna scratch my nub. Oh. She has a hard time scratching anything. <laughs> you gonna go see Echo or Cammy? Echo, go see Cammy. Oh. Oh. See, she doesn't bend very well. Cammy's trying to get her to wrestle. Her wrestling consists of um, being on her back, rubbing her little mouth around with Cammy, and that's it. And they play. There you go. That's wrestling. Not real exciting for everybody else, but for Echo, it's fun. It's a little bit of personal activity. She goes, okay, I'm done. <laughs> we do have her um, whelping pen ready, which is just a pool. Look at that belly. I know, look at your little tail just a going. Her whelping pool has been set up in my room. And one thing I've realized this time around, and I think it's because she's bigger, she likes any extra sheets. And look at that, look how she lays. She always lays with that foot out now. Any extra sheets in her bed, she likes them around the edge of the pool on the inside. And it gives her something to prop her body up on. So as long as all those sheets are in there, she's happy as a little lark just to sleep in there all night long. And if for any reason they get moved out, she'll move with them and sleep on them. So I think up until the minute they're born, I think we're going to leave all those sheets in there. She gets very tired, very easily. I'm That's sorry, this is not... Asleep. She's falling asleep laying up. I'm sorry, this is not a very exciting video, but we do only have two weeks left. And so she's a big girl. Come on, X. You want to lay down, honey? Ugh. 
Look at that belly. Look at that belly. You want to see if she wants to wrestle, Kimmy? Oh, she's going to wrestle with me. Look at this. She's going to try to wrestle with me. Why don't you wrestle? This is wrestling. On her back, chewing on... That's it right there. That's her wrestling. <laughs> she really enjoys it. She has a lot of fun. Look at the belly. Oh my goodness. I'm just so amazed at how big she's getting. And I think these babies, they grow a lot in the last two weeks of pregnancy. So all I keep thinking is, oh my gosh, she's going to get really, really huge. Oh, sneezy. If you look at that face, look at that. She looks really vicious. She's <laughs> so much for being vicious. <laughs> oh, she got the sneezies now. <laughs> Give her a hug. Echo loves her little hug. She's going to wag her nub. See her little nub. Oh, yep, there it goes. Her little nub goes. <laughs> And just that little bitty, oh, she's investigating the stuffed animal pile. What she can find. And that little bitty wrestling that she did just now, it wears her out. As soon as we're done here, she'll go to sleep for a bit. Do you want to sit for mommy? Sit? No. You sit down and I'll give you a treat. Good girl. Oh, oh my gosh, it's unfair. Get These are actually, they're dog treats, but look at this. They are, we buy them for the rat. They're called Charlie Bear treats. And because they are the rat's favorite treats, we buy them for the rat. There he goes. There's with his other little treats. He's going to go hide in his little blankets and he's going to eat his treats. But that's cheeseburger. He heard the bag and he knew that was treat time. What? This is her thing too. Putting her paw in your hand these days. And she's awfully licky. She wants to lick everything. Oh, fump. Oh, poor thing. She's so tired. All right. Look at that. Kimmy's going to use her as a pillow. Barely. She's perfectly happy with it. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear her breathing. She's breathing really hard. She always breathes really hard. And you can tell when the babies start moving because she starts jumping and then she starts <gasps> breathing real hard. Yes, look at that little face. She's so sad looking, Cammy. You can hear her breathing. She's a beautiful girl. Anyways. This is Echo's Pregnancy Week 7. We are in her 8th week right now, so we have a little over a week and a half to go. And then it's pee day. We call that pee day, puppy day. We will actually start on lockdown here in about a little over a week and a half. We'll be on with her in the bedroom. Now, um, we are not leaving her alone at all from here on out. She won't go in the kennel with nobody home. Either Cammie or myself will be with her at all times because... Her being so big, I don't know how things are going to go. And I know there's dogs out there that have been bigger, but she's our baby. She's spoilt rotten, and we don't want anything to happen to her. Alrighty. I am going to let Echo go sleep. She'll crash here for about another hour or so. And we'll see you all next week. And if there's any changes or anything, we'll let you know ahead of time. Thanks. Y'all have a great week. Bye-bye.